All right, today we're going to be reviewing an all-time favorite, the Estes Big Bertha. Similar to the Baby Bertha, just a little bit bigger. Uh, it's got your traditional rounded nose cone, which I definitely like that design. On the end here, we did make some modifications of our own. It has a 24mm motor mount and a hook where the kit comes with an 18mm motor mount. But uh, we did review this kit earlier on the channel, and we found that uh, it flies a little bit better on a bigger motor, so we added that in there. And, uh, to, uh, you know, to compensate for that, we added some nose weight up here, which we just used some poster putty. Works great. Flew it twice a day, and it worked well. So, inside the rocket, let's take a look. We got our Kevlar shock cord, which, uh, this was a modification that we made, as well as a swivel that we added to prevent some tangling. We've got our 18-inch parachute that comes with the kit. Um, and actually with the Kevlar today, I should remind you that Kevlar is uh, fire resistant, not fireproof. Actually, our Kevlar did burn today, and uh, we almost lost our nose cone, but luckily it held on long enough for us to recover it. And then we launched it a second time with just a knot, and it flew fine. But we will be adding some wood glue to that, as it would be a shame to lose this, uh, or to lose the nose cone or something. Um, overall, very fun rocket kit. Uh, I definitely like it, which is why we bought a second one after our first one crashed on its so probably 15th flight. Um, but overall, I give this rocket a 4.5 out of 5 stars. Thank you. Ready? Launching in 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. That is up there. horses step on it. Or the horses step on it. It's good out there. Just hit the mountain. About to hit that horse.